get ready for Mikey Sun TV. Four, three, two, one, zero. going on guys how's everyone doing today i'm doing well thank you for asking what are we going to do today what's going on well i've done a few videos today i've been busy 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 putting stuff out putting content out i hope you're keeping up on mikey sun tv if you're not you should because i'm awesome or so says myself <laughs> uh, anyway guys today it's been a long time coming. That's what she said. We're gonna work out a little bit of chest today, possibly a little bit of shoulders as well. Okay? So, I technically have not worked out my chest in a good five years. This is going to be workout number uno. Okay? So, I'm gonna take it easy. What does that mean? Well, I'll probably be doing the 80 pound dumbbells. <laughs> probably knowing me. So, as you can tell, I got my room kind of nice and situated, looking good. Let me give you one quick little go through here. Ooh, isn't it pretty? Ooh, ooh, it's gorgeous. Look at this, gorgeous. Eh? Eh? The hills are alive. Anyway, now that I'm dizzy, all right. So we're gonna do a little chest. And I'm here to inspire you and help you get through this chest routine. We're gonna take things slow and easy because number one, like I said, it's been a good five years since I've worked out my chest. Number two, you might be new and you might need to go slow. So let's get started. All right. Get the seat set up. I'm gonna do inclines because doing incline presses was always uh, my favorite. Um, of course, I always did the most weight doing flat bench, but I like doing incline. Now, I don't know what degree I have this on, but we're going to work with it like this and see how it goes. Let me grab my dumbbells. <clears throat> All right. Well, technically, we're working with probably about 25 pound dumbbells here. And that's really light. But, you know, we don't need to push things right now. So we're going to take it light. Okay? Oh. Now, we'll get them set up easy on our legs. Now, with me, I got to do it a little differently. Your dumbbells might be flat on the sides, where mine is not. So, all right, let's take this nice and slow, guys. All right, incline is tricky, but you get those stabilizing muscles uh, doing uh, double time pretty quick. Get you a nice little stretch here. Okay. I'm going to turn my wrist a little bit. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There we go. That's some good reps, guys. Uh, 
Now you'll notice, you'll notice mine are a little bit more awkward right now because I have the extensions here, you know, the bars. So it's hard for me to kind of go in boop, and hit, but you manage, you know, you learn how to do it. So let's go, let's talk about uh, the movement. You want to take it nice and easy. Now, like I said, when you do incline presses or any kind of incline anything, uh, your stabilizing muscles, your little bitty muscles off in here, they get worked over time because you're at a, at a strange angle and your muscles are trying to compensate and your brain's trying to compensate and keep everything. You got to find that sweet spot to where it's, to where it all moves fluently and, uh, smoothly and, and proper. Okay. And you're going to feel where that spot is. It's going to be like right in the middle there. It's like, you'll find it. So, all right. Uh, I think this time, I think now we'll do some dumbbell flies. Now I'm going to take it super easy on this. If you keep up with my channel, you know that I have a really bad shoulder. Scar tissue goes down into my bicep and it feels like it's ripping off the bone. However, the last couple of weeks, it's not been bothering me. Five years, it's been excruciating pain. All of a sudden, not bothering me. So I'm going to take it easy. So let's set the camera up over here and we're going to do some flies. Okay? All right. Again, I'm doing incline. And I hope that I can, that I'll be okay here and I won't hit nothing. We'll see. And you just gotta take it easy, find your spot, get situated. And flies are really simple, okay? You come out like this, I'm not gonna go too far and go up and squeeze. You wanna squeeze the chest, guys. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. Now see, I was about on my ninth one before I was feeling kind of comfortable of how I needed to do my dumbbells. So it can take a minute, guys. All right, so basically at this point, we've done one set of dumbbell presses incline and one set of dumbbell flies incline okay now i'm gonna i'm gonna do the rest of my sets i'm gonna do about two or three more sets of each and i'm not gonna film that i don't want to bore you with it uh so we'll catch back up after i do my sets stay tuned guys All right, well, I wasn't gonna film any more of the basic workout, but I went up to 40 pounds on my dumbbells to do some presses. So, 10, 20, 30, 40, plus the bar, you're looking at probably roughly 45 pounds. So I just wanted to get one little uh, set of me doing these just for fun, okay? Yeah, they got a little bit more weight to them. All right. All right, let's do them. Nice and easy. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 10, 11, 12, 13, 
14, 15. All right. Good job. Guys, I hope you're still doing yours. All right. Eventually we're gonna do maybe full length, uh, full length videos where we're going over some, uh, you know, a couple sets here and there, some movements, maybe some like, you know, move, you know, some stretching or some, just something, you know, to kind of give us some uh, content for a, a little fitness show maybe, you know? Nothing extravagant, nothing crazy. So, all right, I'm gonna get in uh, another set of those and go from there. All right. All right, guys, I'm done with chest. I did flies and I did presses. And uh, now I'm gonna do a little bit of shoulder uh, presses. Dumbbell shoulder presses. And when you do these, you wanna, just like with every movement that we do, you wanna keep control of them through the whole motion. You wanna stay, you wanna keep yourself nice and tight and tense and straight and uh, try not to compromise any part of your body for the sake of the movement, okay? You want everything to go smooth, easy, and right, okay? And I'm just going, I went back down to the uh, 20 to 20 pounds uh, on each, on each bar. So, uh, depending on how you do it, you can touch the dumbbells together, you can supinate your wrist, you know, turn them, uh, you can do whatever you want, just stay uh, in a comfort zone and make sure you don't feel uh, weird, awkward, uh, unwanted pains, okay? Pains are good, but the good pains, okay? When you get them up there, you get nice and situated, get yourself ready, and you're gonna go up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, good job. You know, uh, with anything you do, you gotta find that balance point of, of what feels right and what doesn't feel right. So make sure you get in that, that zone and pay attention to what you're doing, okay? All right. So I'm just gonna film the one set with the dumbbell presses, okay? Shoulder presses. I'm gonna do two more sets at least, and uh, then I'll get right back with you. When I'm done with mine, you keep doing yours and you keep control of the weights and make sure you do a weight that's uh, safe for you to handle, especially if you're new to working out. Okay, guys? We'll get back to you. You, know, you keep going. We're doing good, guys. Whew. All right, guys, I am done with three sets of shoulder presses, okay? Uh, I really don't have anything else I'm gonna do for shoulders. Uh, I don't wanna do any kind of a lat raise right now because I don't wanna compromise my shoulder and my bicep and all that right now. So I'm gonna stick strictly with just doing the dumbbell shoulder presses for tonight. Uh, for shoulders and for chest, the incline dumbbell presses and the incline dumbbell flies. Now, if I had maybe some 10 pounds, which I hate to say that, but you know, I'm nursing an injury here. If I had some 10 pound dumbbells or maybe 15s, I might would do some uh, side lateral raises, which are one of my favorite exercises, but they're also, uh, they can also compromise your shoulders if you're not careful. And since I'm, you know, kind of with injury here, man, I don't want to, I don't want to aggravate it. <laughs> so guys, that's all we're going to do tonight. Just a quick little uh, workout video. I'm just doing this to uh, help inspire myself to make myself more accountable for putting out content and in hopes that it inspires you in some way to be active, to walk, 
to jog, to cycle, to get some weight training, to play sports, to kayaking, golfing, uh, whatever it is in the world that you want to do activity wise. Okay. If I can help you reach your goals, great, because you might can help me reach mine too. All right. And you can help do that by liking, sharing, subscribing, and commenting on all my videos on Mikeyson TV. Okay. Check out the playlist. I have everything in the world in there that you could possibly enjoy. Okay. Also check out just the regular video section. There might be some videos that aren't in playlist. Who knows? Also check out my other channel, Old Mental Pickle. That's where I only live stream video games. Now I'm not as active on that channel as I am my main channel, Mikeyson TV, but I try to live stream a video game once a week or so. And uh, you know, we can hang out there and, and chit chat and have fun. You may even join in a, a game I'm playing. That's what it's all about, okay? So guys, Get up, get out, get red, do it to it, and help inspire others while you can, while you're on this earth. Leave all the other stuff behind, the other stuff throughout our days that we can't change, from news and religion and politics and all the disgusting trash that's out there, uh, from rape and pedophilia to murder and everything in between. Guys, leave that all behind and just help to inspire the world, and yourself to do better and be better. All right? We'll see you guys later on the next video. Stay tuned. See y'all later. Get up, get out, get around, and do it, do it!